Okay, so we're on a map that's actually not very good for killer, but we'll see how it goes. Well, we may find that survivors might be a bit more relaxed. That is because we are on the PCB with the brand new killer, the Dredge. Hmm, did wonder if I could hit it, but obviously not the case. The Ash is now wandering away. Gonna be on the gen. Let's go and chase the Leon. Ash seems like he's a good looper. Ooh. So we managed to get the Leon. We've got Hex Blood Power, so that will be working for us in our favour quite effectively. Okay, as he should. It's actually a good uh, pallet to get down. I tell you what, it's uh, a lot of these different animations are really clean. I will say that now. I've already played one game with this killer, actually on the brand new map as well, which was uh, pretty interesting. Okay, two people on here. Ooh, two gen this was another gen that was about to be done. Let's kick it for now. Hmm. Just unfortunately, our hex blood paper just ran out. Let's go back. Kick it again a little bit more. That was restart our, our um, caller brine as well. So they're really wanting to get that particular gen done. While they're not actually um, progressing it, that will get a 200% reduction. Hmm, okay. Nobody went up here. Now this will be interesting. This is a very bright map, by the way. Okay, right. Let's pick them up quickly. Not sure why they came directly in front of me. Oh, I didn't want to go there. Wanted to go up here. Okay, they get the gen done. Oh, that's good. And he went the long route. Hmm. Yeah, this Ash knows what they're doing really well around loot. Of course you've got dead hearts. That was very good. Oh, we tried getting into that. Oh, somebody's also got a flashlight. A little bit early. Almost perfectly well done by the two of them, actually. That's a tad too early, though. Okay, another gen just went off, but I didn't get the notification as to where that went. Got the save. Just remember, the Ace has also got dead hard, so... Got 
without wanting to use it. He will probably have DS as well, so let's take it off of him. Of course he does. So it does seem like that those two are working closely together, which is, you know, is obviously, um, obviously they're possibly a duo, so... Gonna have to come away and come and deal with this. Not sure why you would stick on that, to be completely honest, but... Hey-ho! Where's... Okay, I had no auras of any hook. <laughs> that must really send shivers down their spines doing that. You know, it does give them that bit of time to be able to get away. They tried to get me to come off the area, which they didn't manage. I suppose there's no... Oh, the pallet's here. <laughs> yeah. Hexbud favor does come in quite handy. He is dead hard as well, so... Yeah, two gens does get done in the process. The good thing for this type of killer is that it can, um, it does have overall map pressure, which is good. Somebody wanting to come in directly for the save immediately. Oh, a little bit of lag. Let's see, um... So the ace is just there. There's not really too much point of me going elsewhere. But to be honest, like they should be doing the final gem, but they're just hovering around for some reason. So this is good for me. Hmm. Okay, that was actually a good job from the team there. Let's go and get them all injured. Obviously there is somebody on the gym, possibly on the opposite side of the map. Hmm. Okay, so we're going to get uh, Killer Instinct. Um, I believe that it's only available when we are actually um, got them all cloaked in darkness. That's very good from her. Yeah, Ace is here because he's not injured. He's trying to cover off uh, the new girl. We'll go after the Leon. He's on a gen and still injured. Not sure if we'll be able to punish that quite hard enough. But we'll see what we can do. We'll make him to make the move. But we'll quickly get him hooked up. This will be only on second hook if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, they're actually coming in for the save. Well, at least they'll try to. There was two survivors this direction. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to come up here. Because this allows me to do um, multiple things. I'll be able to know the ace is coming over, so that's fine. We'll go and get the ace now. We've gone for the save. And the yeah, ace mucked up a bit. Now we are going to go to the other side of the map in a minute. Not sure why she's trying to get a flashlight save there.
Okay, they're going up that way. Let's go into one of these lockers. I think he's literally just put that lock on. So the survivors can actually lock up each of the lockers around the map. And they stay locked apart from one of two reasons. Um, because you have actually unlocked the, um, the locker itself by going into it. And then obviously jumping out of it. So we might as well go for the ace here. I'm not sure why they're still around here. They should have got the final gem by now, I would have assumed. Yeah, this ace knows what they're doing. Like That's a kind of like neat little trick that I found out. Um, you can actually use your, um, your remnant. Oh, okay, they were actually on it. Okay, she will probably have DS. Let's pick her up anyway. Oh no, she doesn't. Oh yeah, because she tried to heal, didn't she? Yeah. She tried to heal so she would have lost DS. Hmm, okay. No hook there. Does she have breakdown maybe? Where's the ace? Got the Leon. That's actually fine. I don't mind um, her being picked up, if I'm totally honest. The reason why I say it is because she will wiggle out as soon as I try to pick her up. Good dead hard. Doesn't really get you anywhere though, sadly, Leon. And here's the Mori, by the way. I do like it. My first impression. He legit eats them. <laughs> he legit eats them. In an unnatural way. So my first initial thought when I saw the first half of the Mori was that I believed... Um, I'll do that. Hmm. Okay, let's see it again in the exact same place, by the way, funny man. Uh, I'll tell you what, this Mori, this new Mori, oh, actually, let's wait for our action to come back up. They're doing this like a nail. Hmm. Maybe not. Nice job from the ace. He actually got that final gen done.
But this ace has been the reason why they've done, this team has done so well. He's done a lot for his team altogether. I'm going to keep the ace on this side. Oh, he's going. Where did he go? Can he open up the lockers? Even under lock for me. Pretty interesting if he if he can do that. Yeah, he's over here. Well played. Well played to the ace. He played that extremely well. He baited me somehow. I'm not sure exactly what he did. But... Yeah, it's a, it'll all be interesting. But you can see the power with the dredge already. You know, obviously, this is only my second ever game with the dredge. So bear that in mind. You know, that I am... Trying out some different techniques and trying out some different builds of the dredge this particular build I haven't varied from this build yet, but I do have an apple couple other builds in mind I do so this one is a general um, It's majoritively gem protection. So you've got call of Brian and eruption, which is you're seeing quite a lot of I don't have pop goes the weasel yet, but I feel like the hex blood favor is a very good perk on any um, What I would call most basic m1 killers anyway um, which the dredge is because he doesn't really use his power to be able to um, hit a survivor in any way. He uses the power to teleport around the map, which is where you're finding that map pressure. And I would say as well as another thing, like although they obviously toned down their aggression quite a lot for some reason, it shows that there is some good benefits of the dredge as well. So hopefully we'll be able to play some more games of the dredge. I am going to be playing some more over the coming day or so um, and we'll see how it goes as well so you'll probably see a little bit of dredge um, PTB content um, I'll even try and sneak in a little survivor game possibly in between as well so hopefully you'll be able to find out how how it feels going against the dredge not just playing as the killer him itself because it's not obviously a he or a she it is an it because it is a genderless killer it is a it is a monstrosity, let's just say that. But I am having fun with him, I will be honest. And if you're enjoying him as well, let him know. Let me know in the comments and the description below. If you're not enjoying playing against him, let me know maybe the reason why. You know, do you not like that you can just teleport to a locker that you... Like, do you use a locker build, like say you use head-on with inner strength? You know, because this killer can counter that. You know, I haven't seen anybody using that yet. But we'll have to wait and see. It's interesting. But otherwise, if you do like the video, don't forget to click the uh, the uh, subscribe button and also um, click the like button as well. It does help out the channel a lot and I hope you're enjoying the rest of the content as well. But otherwise, hope you enjoy the rest of your day and I'll see you guys next time.